Hi guys, thank you for joining me. In this video, I'm going to be using my new knife. So stay tuned to find out what it is. So the knife I'm going to be using is the new Survival Lily knife. So I'm going to be using it today. I'm going to be using it in my future videos, trying it out. And um, I'm looking forward to seeing what it's like having a go using it. It's a really nice knife. It's come in a really nice sheath as well. And there's a lot of features that's really different and unique with this. So yeah, I'm looking forward to it.
So today has mainly consisted of getting used to the knife and also getting used to the sheath. This is a really different sheath to what I'm used to normally. Um, I usually use the TBS4 knife, so they're very different um, in really different ways. But I've I've enjoyed working with the knife. It's been it's been good fun. It's really heavy duty. I feel like I can whack through and baton a lot of quite large and dense logs with it so yeah that's always nice but it is a really great knife and there's a few features that that are really um, unique and that I like about it so it's got the thumb rest feature at the top here where you can rest your thumb on there when you're doing small work maybe feather sticks or carving I'm a big fan of the 90 degree spine so I'll be using that later with my ferro rod when I go to light the fire at the end of the handle it has a hammer so this can also be used as a lanyard hold for extended grip I've got a nice handle on there and you can also sandpaper it so it fits your hand correctly. It is a full tang blade, which is a nice feature as well. It's a nice sheath as well. It's got the Hot buttons and then it's locked also so it's got two safety features so it's in there nicely it's not gonna come undone it's in there secure yeah all round it's a great survival knife it's got a lot of features on there so if you had to pick up a knife in a survival situation this would be a really good design yeah I'm just getting used to it and I will be using it in other videos telling you how I get on with it. But this is Survival Lily's Knife, who, if you haven't already, you probably have. But she's got a channel, and uh, go check her channel out. She is amazing. She is a really talented and skilled woman who also does like bushcraft and survival, hence her name. And I think it's great that she's made her own knife. I'm really impressed with how the 90 degree spine did. It's really sharp and it worked perfectly. Yeah, I'm really impressed with it. I was looking for a heavy duty knife to like take on survival challenges that you can really, you, it will replace a saw and a hatchet, so that kind of knife. Um, and it's doing a really good job at that. So I will definitely be using this in a survival challenge where you take like a knife and minimal gear, things like that. So I'm just sharpening my knife with the Apocalypse 1 sharpening stone and the strop also on the back. So this side has got a really nice fine grade um, just to kind of touch it up a bit. And then this one's obviously rougher for when you're starting to sharpen the first stages of sharpening and you finish off with this side. So I've enjoyed using the Survival Lily Apocalypse 1 knife and I'll be using it in more videos. It's great for batoning. It's got a great 90 degree spine for using on a ferro rod or scraping material. I like the emergency hammer at the bottom of the knife. I think that's a great design. And I also like the thumb rest 
so when you're working with bits of wood when doing shavings or feather sticks or things like that it's really nice to be able to have that support and push down without your thumb slipping. yeah it does take a lot of abuse and that's what I like about it it's nice to have a range of knives that can do different things and it's nice to support other women in the community who as we're like-minded and we're sharing our experiences on YouTube doing bushcraft she inspired me to set up my channel about two years ago when I first started setting mine up it's been it's been nice being able to use this trying it out and um, you'll see this more in my videos. So there is a link if you're interested in the knife, you can go check it out, have a look. Yeah, this knife has been great. Really impressed with it. And uh, Survival Lily did a great job with making her own knife.